This is a show dedicated to helping you become a better writer. I'm your host, Tim Grawl, and I am a writer trying to figure out how to tell a story that works. So we're going to talk about the narrative device, the pattern that we're using to help you write your next short story. That's Eyewitness from Ed McBain which is a great story. And I highly recommend that you grab the anthology that that's included in. The cool thing about the narrative device is you get a very specific target, a very specific relevance filter. And everything within our 624 analysis builds on another. So we talked about the the pop last time. We originally called it the what if and then gained some great refinement, which I'm really excited about. And the pop is what leads right into narrative device. Just to go over our pop, that's our proposition of possibility. And for this story, it's when corruption is endemic in the police department, is being a witness worse than being a victim? That's where we're going to start. And then that takes us into our narrative device, which is the author who is telling the story to a single audience member to help them solve a problem. Imagine that the author and the Sam single audience member are sitting in a coffee shop having coffee and Sam says, author, I've got a problem. And then the author spins out a story that illuminates the problem. They don't give them advice and say, oh, this is what you should do, Sam. They say, let me tell you this story. The thing I want to say about that is that focusing on Sam and focusing on Sam's problem is going to solve so many problems because the mass audience that you want to talk to gives you no relevance filter, really. 